Hi and welcome to Fast Tech Skills. I'm Human, your host, and in this video, I'm gonna talk about what is front end and what is back end. You hear these words these days very often when it comes to building a technology uh, product, a technology based product. So if you've ever used any website or web app, you're familiar that you, in your browser, you type the address and uh, the website opens up. And you get multiple elements, uh, text, uh, images, maybe forms, different interactive elements. Or if you've ever used a mobile app, which I'm pretty sure you have, uh, when you open the mobile app, you have different elements, a list view, action bar in, in case of Android, uh, you have different elements on a mobile app as well. These elements that you see on your client side, so whether you have a laptop or a mobile device, if you're using a browser or an application, basically what you're looking at is the client side of uh, a bigger application. And let's talk about how it works and why this is the client side. In today's world that you have user accounts and authentication and massive amount of data uh, on the cloud, it's not possible to have a copy of all the information on every single uh, user's device. That's practically impossible. You can't have all the user's information on all the devices. So when, it, when the user installs the app for the first time, they can authenticate and the app can look up all the user's uh, info on that particular phone. Security risk, storage issues, it's just impossible. So the best approach is to store all the user data, all the user information on a, a server, on a cloud, uh, on the cloud, and um, you give access to the client side, which could be a web application or a mobile application, and then that particular client side can talk to your server via multiple uh, ways and uh, that could be di uh, via different requests for files, for authentication, uh, basically for information. So now that we have this approach in place, now that we have this architecture in place, that we have a server that holds all the kind of user information and handles it in one single place, then our application will be divided or our uh, kind of a service or project will be divided in two different parts. One part that we will send to the user, whether uh, in form of a website or a web application that they kind of get through their browser or download uh, via the App Store or Google Play on their mobile phones and via that specific interface, via that front end, they talk to our servers, they talk to our database, or maybe our main server talks to a file server to uh, store and serve photos, images, photos or uh, videos, or maybe in the database you keep a record of the user's post or whatever information that you need to store from the app or send back to the app that user uh, currently uh, kind of uses on their devices. So whatever kind of the left, right side is, uh, is our backend, a combination of our main server, which uh, receives the request from the web application or mobile application and kind of processes those requests and uh, kind of grabs the necessary information from the database or grabs the file from the file server and sends it back to the mobile app. So basically that's it for this video. Front end is the part of your application which lives on the uh, mobile devices or web uh, kind of browsers that users are using. That's what you send to the user and they install on their devices. Uh, mostly the user interface, some basic uh, local storage functionalities and the stuff that you can send and the user can keep on their devices and build a better interface to work with your uh, kind of service. And uh, we have the backend, that's where you store the precious information, the user's data, and whatever you want to have in a single place. So uh, that's it. Like this video if, uh, of course, you liked it. Subscribe to my channel for more of these videos. 
uh, so I can see the number of subscribers rise and I get motivation to do more of these videos. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Have a good day.